But yeah, I be doing class. I am. Who told you that? And who told you how old I was anyway? You really think that I accomplished everything that I accomplished? You, it takes time to do stuff like this. To like be where I am and be able to move how I need to. Well, not really. It's people being becoming millionaires every day. Younger and younger. So. So, it really doesn't matter. I just. I just thank God because he's been preserving my youth. He's been making me look young for a long time. For real, for real. And I wonder. And when I get these vending machines, it's up and stuck for real. It's up and stuck for real. It might take me at least maybe about you know, a couple months to make my investment back. But once I get them in some good locations, I'm thinking about putting them in some dope mall locations for real. <sighs> but that's, that's the last time I'm gonna speak about that. Because one thing I don't like to do is speak about stuff before it happens. I don't. I don't. I mean, I could speak into existence to myself. Speak to it, you know, speak about it to God, but I really don't like to talk about, like, speak stuff out. Because it'd be some people watching. It'd be some people watching. <laughs> Y'all, business is such an amazing field to be in because guess what? It's always going to be generations of people who want to learn from you. Who want to learn what you're doing and that's why if you become somebody people can learn from you're going to always make money because there's generations of people being born every day that need to learn what you know you're never going to run out of money you're never going to run out of something to do because all you got to do is teach somebody teach somebody who don't know teach somebody who's struggling teach somebody who's trying to come up and that's your income right there. What the watch got going on? What is you talking about? I don't even know what you're talking about. I don't know what you're talking about. I know for a fact you ain't talking about my watch I got, got on. Need to be probably tightened up. I don't know what you're talking about. Not really. Really don't. How y'all talk out here be a little different. We have to play hooked on phonics. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> mm -mm. It's inventory day. I just found out how to make massive profits. Not only doing, um, not only doing wholesale, I came up with something else. <laughs> and that y'all, that's literally like, it's so crazy to me. Every time I talk to somebody from out here, I want my old nigga back. Because y'all talk just how he talk. Because he's from here, of course. But I be giving him time to get his life together. I think he's just never had nobody like me. So he don't know what to do. And that's fine. But my thing about it is. Men need to learn how to like. Like. For some reason, I think I get the vibe that y'all be thinking stuff gonna be just like a fairy tale when y'all first get into situations when anything good you gotta build it. For some reason, younger people, y'all think that everything is gonna be some type of glitter and butterflies. 
when you get and stuff like no you have to build a foundation which means you have to get to know people you have to learn how to stick and stay with stuff now right you gotta learn how to um first of all you gotta go into anything you do knowing that it ain't no plan b what i'm doing is what i'm doing because it's what i want to do and i ain't it ain't it ain't never finna be nothing else but what i'm doing right now you gotta have that mindset or you already off Cause you somehow thinking that the grass is gonna be greener somewhere else, and you just already messed up already. That ain't how it go. Not how it goes. Y'all be watching too much Instagram. People who got situations they've been in for a minute, it's cause they built that. They ain't come like that. They built that. You got to be able to look at somebody when they look in a hot mess and be like, so what? He a human. She a human. They still mine. We still doing this thing. We still building. We still got something to do. You feel me? Like, it's a longevity mindset. But these newer kids, they think that everything just going to, like, stuff just going to fall out the sky or something like that. And I'm talking about anybody from 20 to 30 because 29, we are still young and we still living fast and we still thinking, you know, whatever. But I just, I'm more of a subtle type of person, so I see things differently. And I know that the, it takes you to build stuff for it to last. Like when I bought that house, it looked at a hot mess. I had so many of my friends telling me, why you buy that house? Blah, blah, blah. This, that, this, that. Like, that right now, they sitting there trying to figure out how I'm already on to the next level. It's because I didn't take a second to think about how that house looked. I didn't care. I was already on go when I bought it. I was on go and I didn't stop. I didn't let up, period. And I'm never going to let up on nothing that I do, especially not in a relationship. Because if I put myself in it, you two, we doing inventory today. Anybody? Tap in. But um, anything that I do, I'm not going to waste my time with it because I'm not going to invest my time or no money or nothing with somebody I'm not about to work with because that is a waste. I don't waste nothing. I'm not into wasting nothing. I grind too hard to waste anything. With that being said, if I get into it, it's just what it is. We finna rock out. Now you finna be disrespectful. You finna be crazy. But we finna... We finna do something big, like, cause everything I do is big. I'm not with all that, oh, oh, today's not a good day. I don't think we, I think we should take a break. I don't think we should, I don't think we can do, like, what? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? You don't even make no sense. I don't do stuff like that. Like, to me, that's just, that's not giving what it's supposed to give. I don't even want to be with nobody who think like that because you you already, we're not on the same page. You in the way. I need the psychopath. That's crazy about me. <laughs> like, what are you talking about? For real. The one who, when I tell him to leave me alone, he's outside. Why you being mean to me? <laughs> Like, what? I don't have time for all of that iffy stuff. Because when you when you be consistent, you start to see the beauty and stuff. And for some reason, I think that house was something God was using. Because every time I think about consistency and building an establishment, I think about that house, y'all. And I go back to how it looked in a mess and then it started looking better and then... It, it was just a beautiful masterpiece and then I had people wanting to buy it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's levels to everything. You can't think that, oh, everything supposed to come. Like, you you crazy. You crazy if you think you ain't got to work to put something together. You out your mind. Like, literally out your mind. You need to go back and, 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 and learn some more because that ain't what this is. Everything in life, you gotta work at it. You see them people smiling, couples go this and that. They took time to learn each other. And 
and they knew it wasn't nowhere else they would rather be than continue to build what they started. Who gonna start something and then not finish it? That don't even make no sense. Don't make no sense. Don't make no sense. If you start and finish it, you heard? I like that because y'all be tripping on her. And y'all be talking all the time. I be doing my doing my inventory and I never be talking to myself. Mm-mm-mm. We're gonna get into it. Make sure, ladies, that you are at the uh event right, the virtual last wholesale marketing event make sure that you tune in um to trendsetters on the go on patreon and spotify make sure that you inquire about stretch the money the business series to get you in the mindset of a successful entrepreneur also hit me at down at the billionaire at gmail.com for any business inquiries regarding to investments, real estate, business planning, expansion, exit strategies, um, marketing strategies, um, how to become a whole la wholesale lash vendor. Um, I don't know. I think I said the event right. That's coming up. That's October 20th. Don't miss it. Oh, this week I'll be going live a lot simply because God told me to. <laughs> and just always check my link tree for any upcoming oops. Yeah, this is, for any upcoming events, any new things that I'm doing. Whoever do not know me, if you are new here, I'm Donna the Billionaire. I'm a business, um, a business and financial coach. I'm also an investor. And so everything I else, everything else that I do is just creativity. My last company, my books, my podcasts, my digital products, my ebooks, my um, my self help guides. I got a self improvement podcast, so I put out like self help guides on how to be more productive and entrepreneurship and stuff. Just everything that I do. Make sure that you check my link tree. And so I want to help 20 women start their lash businesses. And so make sure you inquire about the marketing event because you will receive 50 free boxes. It's going to be a mixed, um, a mixed um, box of lashes. You're going to receive 50 free packs of lashes if you attend the marketing event. So inquire about it. I love you guys and I will see you in my next video.